Before the president was speaking, we mentioned that the first suspect, Tamerlan, actually was married to a woman in North Kingstown. That's right, married and have a little child. And our Ted Nisi has been down in North Kingstown. He has more on this story now. Ted, what can you tell us? Mike, Susan, uh, according to uh, family members here, the 24-year-old Catherine uh, Catherine Russell, who lives, uh, whose family lives in this house behind me, she was the wife and the mother of the child of the first suspect in the Boston Marathon bombings. Now, this is a quiet cul-de-sac in North Kingstown. Neighbors say they were shocked this morning at 7.30 when they woke up and looked around and saw a state police cruiser and FBI agents coming to this home. Now, uh, we have talked to those neighbors, and they did say that after her first year of college, uh, when Catherine came back, she, she seemed to have changed and become much more religious. Here's what one of those neighbors had to say. I, had, I saw the four cars out in front of my house. There was one car parked sort of catty corner, so I thought that was weird. And I wondered why the state patrol would be here. And then I saw him, uh, the patrol officer, get into his car, and then I saw a gentleman come out, and he... Um, had a big thick vest on and when he turned around it said FBI which made me feel really weird and I thought something's got to be going on and then there all of the excitement with you know this manhunt it did make me think is this in any way could this be connected And we now know tonight that uh, the family saying, yes, this is connected. Uh, Tamar, they're saying they released a statement saying they're horrified and shocked by this, and uh, they asked for their privacy. So that's the news right now in North Kingstown about the connection to the bombing. Ted Nisi, Eyewitness News.